Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So the Cable and Sasquatch Arena is over, round two, done. And we're going to find out how I did and check out the leaderboards and see what we can see. All right, now I didn't go for Cable or any of them, I already have them. Uh, but we can at least give some shout outs to our friends. So let's go ahead and uh, switch over here. All right, so... Just went for milestones for the most part. Uh, and I tried to put up as much as I needed to to get the 5,000 shards. All right. And, uh, oh, you're kidding. Wow. I ranked 259. All right. We're going to look at that. I'm going to show you guys the score I put up. But, um, I might have to tone down my routine. Uh, uh, clearly, I put up too much. He went too low. All right, let's start with the uh, four-star featured here. We're just going to go from left to right and see what we can do. Or who we can see, rather. Sorry, that kind of threw me. Um, did not think I was going to pick up cable. Um didn't want to, would actually rather have the 5,000 shards because that will give me more tries for Cosmic Ghost Rider uh, as a five star when he does get to the uh, basics or Captain Marvel movie. But I'll be able to open up more crystals. So I'm trying to get as many of those five, uh, five star shards as I can. All right. Uh, so far, I don't see anyone's name that I recognize here. I'm going to try to look a little closely so I don't miss people. Uh, FaZe, congratulations, man. I think that's how you say your name, FaZe, right? I always want to say like Faws. I don't know why. Sound out every word, uh, every letter. Okay. Hmm. No, no, no. <laughs> Dark Chub. I don't know why that, that makes me smile. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Jake Nasty. Okay, all right. Uh, let's see. Don't see anyone. Uh, Cable is not a great champion. He was a big disappointment when he came out. Uh, the only thing that is saving him is Apocalypse. Apocalypse has the ability to make horsemen out of any mutant. And when Cable becomes a horseman, he's actually really good. So, other than that, if you don't have Apocalypse, uh, Cable is going to sit there more than likely uh, in your roster. If you're an arena grinder like myself, then you'll at least get a chance to use him in the arena. Other than that, I don't use him. All right. Let's see. Don't see anybody's name that I'm recognizing here. Not surprising. Nobody really wants him. He's not new. And uh, the four star especially. Uh, the game is, is moving. Uh, four stars are nowadays like three stars used to be you know they can still be useful but the end game content aside from some um certain encounters certain mechanics you know certain cheese options you're probably not going to be using you know a four star in there you know but you know before they changed it uh, you could have brought a four-star Angela into Cavalier Difficulty. She rocked that chapter. Um, the Integral. Congratulations, man. But, yeah. Um, all right. Yeah, so four stars are not, you know, all that popular these days. So I'm not surprised. We're going to skip the three-star. Uh, because you get the three star just for doing all of the milestones. 
uh, for any of the featured arenas. So not the basic arena. So speaking of the basic arena, here we go with the basic one. You can see I was able to stop right after like 1.5 million. Uh, did not want to risk getting him and I'm going to have to do something like that in the uh, five star featured arena as well. All right, but uh, Sasquatch is actually pretty cool. Uh, if you don't have the four star, uh, picking him up, not bad. Uh, if I didn't already have him, I would have gone for him simply because I like to collect champions. Uh, I currently have every four star uh, outside of a couple of trophy champions. Uh, I don't have Thanos and I don't have Red Deadpool. Uh, but if I can get them, I will. Black Gamer, congratulations. Um, but yeah, if they offer, you know, that red Deadpool again, uh, I'll, I'll get him. At the time that they did it, uh, you had to pay a, a small amount for a ticket. And then that gave you entry into his arena. So you could spend the money and still not get it if you didn't have the roster. And at the time, I did not have the roster. I was not confident that I'd be able to put up a score that would get him. Now, at that time, four stars were way more popular. So, but if, if they bring it back, I will go for them. Uh, provided that they don't charge a whole lot. You know, five bucks is okay. Um, maybe even 10 bucks, but yeah, beyond that, probably not. All right. So I'm not seeing anybody that I recognize other than, um, a couple I already mentioned. I'm trying to, uh, yeah. you know, that last name, uh, Trang, I, I don't know how to pronounce that name, but I worked with someone uh, who had that last name. So when I see it, I'm just like, oh, and I kind of remember. I need to reach out to her and see what she's doing these days. All right. <clears throat> Let's see. No, no, no. Slaughterhouse? Okay. So this arena is percentage based. So, you know, we've got a lot of people that got this champion. Uh, the four star featured, that's uh, the top 800 get that champion. Uh, we only get to see the top 200. But this one, um, I think it's, it's thousands of people that get the champion uh, since it's percentage based. <clears throat> okay. All right, so that is that leaderboard there. And all right, so all we got left is this one where I picked up Cable, not meaning to. I mean, I'm not mad at the 400 six-star shards or anything, you know, but, oh, man. All right, anyway, that's the score I put up. Um, uh, apparently it was too much. My normal routine is to run through my five stars once. And then after that, just hit my six stars up every time they're off cooldown. That's all I do. But the problem is my roster has grown. And so going through my five stars and then hitting up the six stars uh, you see what happens. That's the score that I put up. So what I'm going to have to do now uh, is maybe either not go through all of my five stars uh, or just stop. When I get to like 22, uh, just stop. My problem, of course, is that I'm a completionist. And so I hate leaving things uncompleted. Uh, so if I'm going through my six stars, I want to finish my six stars and I'm going through my five stars. I want to finish those, but 
Uh, I can do it, especially if I'm going to accidentally uh, pick up champions that I don't really, you know, want. But I'll take those six-star shards. You know, definitely not mad about that. Um, I have a six-star I could open right now, but I'm trying to save. And uh, maybe I can do like a two six-star opening or something. Coat hanger. Congratulations. That's what's up. All right. Um, let's see. Anybody else I recognize here? <laughs> Cute. All right. And this arena is top 300. So if, uh, if you got the champion and your name is not here, feel free to leave a comment and let me know. But as you can see, I got him accidentally. Because I did not want him. I already have him and he's awakened. However, um, I might be able to make him a horseman and, you know, level him up and all that good stuff. But I probably won't. Probably will not. All right. So top 300, get a champ, this champion here. And uh, we're coming down to the end here. I, a lot of names I, I'm actually not recognizing. You know, a lot of times uh, you get familiar with the names. You see some of the same names over and over again on the leaderboards. Um, but for this one, uh, I'm seeing a lot of names for the first time. And uh, it might be because they're new. And this is the first time they're going to be able to pick them up a five star or, you know, they just didn't have a cable. All right. Pastor Sammy. Now that's familiar. Uh, congratulations. OK, so that is going to do it, guys. Uh, accidentally got the champion. I'm going to try to keep it uh, below that. Uh, in the case where you have a champion that goes low like this, that can happen. Um, but, you know, for example, Strife has a lot more hype to him. He's not going to be going for anywhere near that score. So putting up that score would be safe if all you want is the 5,000 five-star shards. But for him, I needed to go low. I needed to stay at like 21,000 you know, maybe uh, even 20,000, all right, because he was going low. Anyway, that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.